Looking to save time and boost efficiency? Dive into a collection of free productivity tools and guides. Click the links below in the video description to get your hands on valuable resources for task management, time optimization, and more. Take control of your productivity journey click now. Before we get on to this video, this video is in collab with Studyita. Studyita is a study tuber like me and her videos are really nice and really good. So you better check out her videos and make sure to subscribe to her channel. I will leave the link to her channel in the description box and at the top of this video. And make sure also to check out her video with me in collab. My first tip for you guys is to map out when and what time your finals are. So it's good to see which finals comes first so that you will know which subject to prioritize your studying in. My second tip for you guys is to plan your study session. Designate a certain time when you are going to study. I suggest you study during a period of time where you are most productive so that you will be able to learn and retain information better. Also, be sure not to fill up your schedule with just studying because this will lead to you having a burnout. So, have some days where you are not studying and just resting or doing productive things other than studying. My third tip is to know what to study. Before you start studying, know what topics are included in your finals. Some professors or teachers will tell you which topics are mostly going to appear during the exam. So, make sure you note it because those lessons will be the most important to study if you want to ace your finals. My fourth tip for you guys is to gauge your understanding. Make a list of what topics are included in your finals. Then, beside each topic, use symbols like dots or stars to gauge how much you understand your lesson. For example, 5 dots means you fully understand the lesson, 3 dots means you understand a bit of the lesson but not fully and one is you do not understand the lesson at all doing this will help you to prioritize which lessons you need to put more time and effort in studying my fifth tip for you guys is to use your past papers when studying for your finals make sure you use the drills seat works quizzes midterms and all the worksheets your teacher has given to you because the teacher might ask similar questions in the finals and this is also one way to see if you understand the lesson or not and this can be used as, as a practice test to help you ace your finals. My sixth tip for you guys is to know how to study the subject. Different subjects require different methods to study. For example, math is all about getting a lot of worksheets and using those worksheets to practice until you get everything right. In a way, you just have to understand the concept and use practice worksheets. Biology is all about memorization, so flashcards is the most useful way to study the subject. Chemistry requires both flashcards and practice worksheets, since chemistry is partly memorization and problem solving. So, before studying a certain subject, be sure to know what kind of studying method is the most effective in studying that subject. My last tip for you guys is to not be careless. Carelessness is one of the reasons why students get low marks or miss a chance in getting a perfect grade. I for once could have got a 95 in my biology test if only I had read the instruction. But because I didn't read the instructions, I ended up with a 64. So please, if I were you guys, read the instructions and questions carefully. Don't make any simple mistake on your calculations. Check your calculator if it is in degree or radian mode. Check if your calculator has batteries or needs a battery replacement. And check what numbers are you inputting in your calculator. 
because you might be inputting 63 times 54 instead of 64 times 54. Want to maximize your productivity potential? Discover a wealth of free tools and guides. Click the links in the video description below to access top-notch resources for streamlining tasks, managing time, and boosting efficiency. Don't miss out. Click now and unlock your productivity superpowers.